Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome back to our special Butterstash.com series on jailbreaking basics using Jailbreak Me. Now we're on our jailbroken iPhone. This is an iPhone 3GS running iOS 4. It's jailbroken, and here is the Cydia icon that Jailbreak Me said it would be on the desktop. See, the one here indicates that there is an update. If you have that option toggled on your iPhone, you'll see that. So we'll tap the Cydia icon. It's loading data. So now we're in Cydia. It's by Jay Freeman. His coding name is Sorik. You can find Cydia on Facebook, and you can follow Sorik on Twitter. Here's a link to Cydia Store products. Featured packages, which we'll talk about in the next segment. Featured themes. Frequently asked questions. Here's information about copying files to and from the device, about OpenSSH, root password how-to, credits, and more. If you tap on City of Store Products, you see there are programs here that you can purchase. And a very nice thing about a jailbroken iPhone is if you buy programs, and then say you get a new iPhone, or you wipe the one you have and re-jailbreak it, when you reinstall Cydia, it remembers all the programs that you've paid for, and you can re reinstall all of them, and it doesn't cost you anything. Down along the bottom, there are sections where you can look for software. Lots and lots of software. You won't believe it until you see it. Under Multimedia, 178 titles. There are a place where there are changes, a place where you can manage packages, sources, and storage, and then a place where you can search for specific programs that you may be looking for. So this is Cydia. It's your gateway to a whole new world with a jailbroken iPhone. Keep in mind, this is a multiple part series and be sure to watch all the parts. Hey, this is Doc. If you're looking for a cheap and easy way to put your own content on the web, go get domain names from Hover.com. Just visit Hover.com slash Butterscotch and you'll get 10% off and support shows like these. Thanks.